Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Uh, yesterday I did some uh, some videos about losing stamps and stuff like that, and I found it again. You probably saw that too. And after that, I made a video using my uh, tablet. wasn't that bad, but I put it down so I was able to use my hands. Uh, it was doable, but it didn't give me the result that I wanted to. So, I'm on my webcam again, and uh, I finished the flipbook that I was working on. So, I wanted to show you that, and here it is, the front. I'm going to put my glasses on and move the camera down, so stay with me, don't get dizzy. So... This is the front of the flipbook and I actually used a tutorial by Felice Loves Paper uh, here on YouTube and I'll link her channel below in the description box. These are all uh, six by six pages and I used this paper pad by Doodlebug of course. What else would I use, right? I always have Doodlebug, it's just the colors are so vibrant and it just makes me happy and crafting makes me happy so those two go, go really well together. Okay, all these papers are double sided so I decided to use just one page and uh, let's see, they all the pages are stuck together with washi tape. I did that on my first flipbook too and I think it all depends on what kind of washi tape you use because well this donut washi tape is by Doodlebug too and it goes with the sweet uh, the cream and sugar line. Um, okay it folds open like so four pages and pages here. So let's just start with the front. Oops. If you close her up, this is the front. And it says, sweet, this cute little die cut um, that is w from the, uh, I think it's odds and ends that it's called. I'm not sure, but it's, oh, it's falling out. It's this package with all the die cuts in there. And uh, that's what I used on this pocket letter, actually. Uh, it's not a pocket letter. Come on, on this flip book. Um, so I used all of these. And you cannot see it here. Maybe if I turn the light on and shine on the thing. See? It shimmers. Whoa, where are you? Yeah, there we go. See the shimmer on the coffee cup? That's what I did with uh, that jelly roll pen. And uh, I'll leave it on. When you open it, you come to the back of the first page. No, not, not. Uh, but this, sweet shop, and a heart. And I out outlined a lot of things again with, see the shimmer, with my jelly pen. And then you open it up and this hello I did with the hello die and this envelope is do the bug paper it's just not from the same line but it goes really well with the color so I use that it's not so thick as this because this is like cardstock paper it's really thick and this is easier to do and this washi tape uh, Jordan bought for me um, she has a channel, but I don't think she makes videos, but I was looking for cupcake uh, washi. She found it at, I think, Hobby Lobby or Joanne's, and she uh, sent that to me when she did a pocket letter swap. So that was that. And then the second page. Don't not worry, be happy. All kinds of sweets. Also outlined with the jelly pen you can see the shimmer and shine and then we go to the third page 
and here I used a stamp from the stamp that I got with the Simon Says Stamp Kit for February. Uh, with enough coffee, anything is possible. I stamped that on vellum, punched it out with my scalloped circle punch and did the same with just like a very tiny dot uh, doodlebug paper and glued that on there. Coffee cup again and this is washi. I don't know if you can really see it. Yeah, you can see it. It's a polka dot pink and I liked it. And this green is totally different. It's not from doodlebug but it goes well with the colors. So there. And then we go to the fourth page. And these are letter stickers that I got at the dollar store. This paper has all kinds of things on it. Hershey Kisses and I Love You a Latte. And here, in here, I made two uh, small pocket envelopes. Let's see. I ordered that from scrapbook.com. Goes with another line. I just traced it and made a template that I could use. And that's what I did for this. And here is just... Uh, paper in that says my favorite things and the with love is with a die I have that's one in here this closes with velcro and I'm not gonna take it out but there's all kinds of stamps and die cuts and whatever in there I filled her up till it wouldn't close anymore so that goes in there. I'll do that later. And I just cut these cards out. These were all on papers. And they're just fun. Put those in there. I'm thinking of putting some uh, washi tape samples in this border. I just cut this with uh, uh, scissors I got for years and years. These makes cute kind of bows. I used to have those border punches but they all died. They broke so I couldn't use that anymore. And then we go to that page. It's a uh, okay it's a little busy on the page with all the coffee cups but I glued these die cuts on and some washi. And then the last page if you close everything up here we go. Cookies and milk. Goes well together. I need something on top of this probably. Not sure about that yet. I'll see. And then I had these uh, closed pins in my stash and I just like it. So if you like this too and want to swap, give me a shout in the comments. Sounds like fun. Okay guys. Whoops. That was every... Oh! Ha! Ah, okay, stay on please. I don't want to make these guys dizzy. That was it. Um, thanks for stopping by. Have a wonderful day. And I'll see you guys later. Bye!